One morning, Max and Min were discussing the physical activities and sports they would play over the coming four seasons of the year. Max was saying, During the summer season, that is in December, January and February, it will get quite sunny and hot, so I think we should join the swim club again and go for those early morning swims. Good idea, Max, replied his sister. And sometimes we can go to the beach and slip, slop, slap and swim in the surf and play in the sand. Max continued, After summer comes autumn, in March, April and May, when the weather starts to cool down a bit and we start to get some cold rains. What do you think we should do then? Well, replied Min, perhaps we could go to the sports club and join a basketball or indoor soccer team. That sounds good, Min. Let's do that. Then we'll come into the winter season of June, July and August. We can play in the soccer competition at O'Brien Oval like we did last year, Min. We had so much fun. Even though it was quite cold and wet some days, we ran around so much we soon warmed up. That leaves spring, said Min, in September, October and November, when the weather starts to warm up again. The trees grow their leaves back and all the flowers and birds return to our gardens. I really love the spring season. Let's just go for walks and play in the park with our friends. That's a great idea, Min. Let's do that. By the way, did you know that because Australia is in the southern hemisphere, that is, in the bottom half of the earth, our seasons run opposite to those in the northern hemisphere. When it's summer here, it's winter in Europe and the USA. With that final comment about the four seasons, Max checked the time on the analogue clock on the wall. The big hand was on 12 and the small hand was on 8, so it was 8 o'clock. He also checked his digital alarm clock and saw that it definitely was 8 o'clock. Time to leave for school, Min. Today we have to be there by half past 8, also known as 8.30. That is half an hour or 30 minutes from now. Do you know the four seasons and the 12 months of the year? You can watch this video again or try the quiz and look at the chart that comes with this video.